And now, the officials are ready. The fighters are in the ring. And they are ready. Boxing fans, are you ready? For the thousands in attendance and the millions watching around the world, ladies and gentlemen, let's get ready to run! Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner with his head trainer, Glenn Rushton. Wearing orange with black, a visual weight, 66.35 kilograms or 147 pounds. This Australian Olympian now has an undefeated professional record consisting of 17 fights, 16 victories with 11 big knockouts, without a loss, one draw from Brisbane, Queensland, he's the fighting pride of Australia, the undefeated WBO number two ranked welterweight challenger in the world, Jeff the Hornet <laughs> And across the ring, his opponent fighting out of the red corner, with his head trainer, Freddie Roach, wearing red and blue and weighing in officially at 66.1 kilograms or 146 pounds. His professional record, 59 victories, 38 wins by knockout. With six defeats and two draws, he's an 11-time world champion in an unprecedented eight different boxing divisions from Saragani province, the fighting pride of the Philippines, the reigning, defending, WBO welterweight champion of the world, Manny Hackman. You had your instructions in the dressing room for the WBO welterweight title. You both know what I expect. A good, clean fight. Obey my commands and protect yourself at all times. Touch gloves. Good luck to both of you. The referee is Mark Nelson from Minnesota in the USA. Mark has refereed over 80 world title bouts, so he's up to the task tonight. As it works out, it's this afternoon here in Australia. Unified rules of boxing, 10 point must scoring system. There is no standing eight count, there's no three knockdown rule. But he cannot be saved by the bell in any round, and only the referee can stop the fight. In case of an accidental foul, we go to the scorecards after the fourth round. The Colonel Bob Sheridan here with Danny Green, the champion. And we get ready. Here we go Manny Pacquiao in red and blue, the Hornet in black and orange. Well, wow, what, what a build up. What a build up it's been. It's exciting, mate. This is awesome. Well, Dean Lonigan has lived up to everything he said he would when he brought him in here. His uh, horn opens up, landing a right hand. Manny hasn't landed anything yet. Horn is anxious, you can tell, but he's a cool customer. Man, he's very calm. He's throwing some nice shots. He's, he's fairly relaxed on such a massive occasion for this young bloke. He's much bigger physically than Manny Pacquiao as well. That was the first thing I noticed, how big he was compared to Pacquiao. But well, one thing about Manny is he's smaller than most of the guys, yeah. but he packs a punch. He's got tremendous. If we get a wide shot during the course of the coverage here, you'll see how massive his uh, legs are and where he generates his power. Yeah, Jeff's, just Jeff can't afford to sit still, which he's not doing. Which, that's why Jeff on there. He's having some good moments there. Manny just laughs at him. Oh, a good shot. Good solid he's right hand. Now. He hasn't thrown anything. He's kind of given away this first round. Back down, of course, the southpaw and the straight right hand down the middle of the horn. He faints. Whoa. He misses. Tell you what, he's not he's not smiling now. Man, he's Manny switched on. Manny, Good stuff in there, Jeff. And you know the other thing I like about Jeff is he's kind of roughhouse him, pushed him off that time, showing his strength, Danny. He has to, mate. Man, hard body shots. Hard body shots by Horn. Manny pulling a bit of a rope, don't you think? Mate, Manny is in a fight. 
Jeff Horn is giving it to Manny Pacquiao the first part of this round. Out comes Manny Pacquiao's mouth guard. He hasn't realized it yet. At least the referee, Mike Nelson, hasn't seen it. Mike Horn is all over him. Quick punch. Time. How can he sustain Time. it? Focus, Manny. Jeff, over here. Oh, stay there. It was Jeff's mouthpiece, not Manny's. But he, he landed a clean shot on Manny Pacquiao. Have the second one ready. Glenn Rushton takes his time, giving his fighter a chance in. to cool Come down in. after how busy he's been in the first round. Thus far, it's Jeff Horn in round number one, but it's a long way to go. Manny goes fishing downstairs with the left hand. It's short. He's, 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 he's doing a great job so far. This is exactly what he's going to do. Can't let the tape pace off. He's got to get him out of his face. He's this big, strong young kid. He's got to impose his will and his strength, Colonel. Quick, go He's, he's taking no guff from Manny, you know, he's not showing him the respect that, you know, maybe a guy who was intimidated because this guy, both of these guys are sweethearts outside the ring, but the horn is a hornet in the ring. He's as tough as they come. Manny reaches with the left hand. Jeff whiffs with his left. As I said earlier on in interview with Fox, Jeff is a very tenacious shot boy. Jeff Manny Pacquiao showed, landing there. Danny, Jeff is showing some nice hand speed here. You know, Manny said he had the power. He clipped him, Manny bent over. Horn never stopped. There's nothing that's intimidating. Jeff Horn, he puts the pressure on Manny Pacquiao. And when the bell sounds, Jeff Horn is going to one round number one. What a fantastic round from Jeff Horn. He was all over Pacquiao like a rash. this fight all the way discipline remember on the gap moving good recovery you did a great job you won that round clearly okay but just be smart be smart all the way don't get carried away don't get careless you boxed a great first round you won that round you want him all time Adam let's keep doing this keep doing that stay in the moment always hands out He actually stung Manny Pacquiao that round, Colonel. That left hand got him, huh? That thudded home. He threw some thumping shots right in front of us just here. He's got to start from the get-go. I wonder whether Manny Pacquiao's taking Jeff Horn a bit lightly. Uh, in his well, lead-up, in his preparation, we'll see. Manny's been down the road a lot of times. Let's see if he turns it up now or not. He wanted Manny likes to feel out early to see what the guy's going to do. Let's see if he turns it up here now. Jeff Horn is uh, very, very aggressive, trying to get Manny off his game, show his own hand speed, and try to land the power shots when he can. And the thing with Jeff, he's imposing his size and his strength, and he's not an easy guy to hit, Colonel. He's not making it easy for Pacquiao. Pacquiao's harder than many clean flush shots. Very hot here. That should be a help to Manny Pacquiao because he trains in the humidity of the Philippines. He got his left hand through. Horn is not landing as much right now. A little bit of needs. feigning. Pacquiao's movement is tough, but he does land the right hand that time. Horn clips him on the left as he comes in. Manny's all, Manny's all serious on his face Stop right now. Punch. Jeff spins him around, and he hasn't been afraid to hit him when they're in a the clinch either. He cannot afford to show Manny Pacquiao the all-time legend any respect if he's to win this fight. It's doing just that. And I was just going to say that, Danny, and so far he hasn't done it at all. This is round two. Of course, it's scheduled for 12, the championship length. Horn off to a nice start, but Manny's been here before. They trade on the inside. Mark Nelson has to separate the two fellas. No intimidation at all. Manny bent over. He's, he's very awkward sometimes, almost to the point. On the inside, Jeff keeps throwing. Manny answers to the body on the inside. Manny goes fishing downstairs with the right hand. If Jeff keeps this up, he's he's gonna he's gonna really affect Manny Pacquiao's zap in his punches. Oh, he's landing good hands. clean shots with the Pacquiao landed a good okay, left hand delivery with a counter shot. Yeah, and that, those left hand uh, shots that we talked about, little shots earlier in the uh, day, can take a toll as it goes on. Good right hand there from Jeff Horn. Lovely shot. Now here's Manny catches him. Back Quick, foot slips out from Jeff, but he's okay. This is a difficult round to score with a little less than a minute to go in round number two. I think Horn has still landed more shots than Manny has. But Manny's clipped the body a very solid left hand to the liver. 
Well, a good chopping left hand, clubbing left, right hand to top of Jeff Horn's head there from Pacquiao. Straight through with that right hand, and that's the way to beat the southpaw. Jeff is better winning some of the battles on the inside, which Manny usually wins. Nice movement. He backs out. He gets clipped with the left hand. Listen to Stop. the crowd reaction when Horn get hit. Well, then all of a sudden, Manny smiles. Good fight so far, Colonel. Great fight. Jeff Horn's giving the crowd what they want to see. Well, if they want to see action, they're seeing it. Manny tries the cut. Oh. Nice feint from Jeff Walk right on to the straight right hand. Hey. At the very end, Manny stole wow. it around. Wow. He's cut Jeff Horn over the right eye. He's got a nasty cut in his right eye. Yep. In and out, in and out. In and out. In and out. I have I have sorry. I have. Yeah. In and out, I have some of my body. Here we go, the replay. Wham. Good left hand there from Manny Pacquiao, counter punching nicely. There's the head clash. There's the head clash that caused that cut over Jeff's right eye. Beautiful body shot there from Jeff Horn. Counter punch from Manny Pacquiao. I'll tell you what, Colonel, it's a great fight so okay. far. Can't ask for more. We moved around number three. Jeff has been damaged. Let's see how he reacts. Battling on the inside, Manny knows how to protect himself on the inside, but Jeff got the best of that. Digs a hard body shot to Manny oh. back yet. Manny's so slick in his movements, he's so subtle in the things he does. That right eye beginning to pump up at Jeff Warren here. We're only in round number three. Jeff's got to keep coming forward. He's got to muscle this guy out of there. He's got to rough him up those inside shots that he was getting in the first round. He's got to continue doing that, showing absolutely no respect, which is a hard thing to do when you have such respect for a legend like Manny Pacquiao, but he's a fighter. Good shot. Took most of the power of that in the back of his uh, hand, Danny. But Pacquiao is so slick. His moves are so subtle. Jeff just trying to keep the pressure on him. And he's doing a nice job with that. And a nice job closing that cut up above his eye in the corner. When they get on the inside, Jeff comes over with that right hand and blasts him every time they're on the inside. But that cut's opened up again now. Good. Good shot by Jeff. And I'll tell you what, Colonel, those little right hands that he keeps clubbing over on Pacquiao's shot. Whoa! Solid left hook. Big left hook. Look at the quickness of Manny on his feet, the way he bounces around. Very tough to get that target. Manny clips him with the right hand coming in. Jeff walks him down, bends him over, and he's not afraid to throw a punch when he has him in that situation. Nice back and forth movement by Jeff Horn. He nails him with the right hand. Backs off Manny, but Manny's so quick as he clips him with the left. Manny throws a combination of punches. He's had punches, but nothing lands. He tries to get the jab upstairs. Horn slides around to his left, sets up. Manny comes in, gets off first. Jeff Horn lets out with the right hand, but misses. Pacquiao tries to cover and he misses. Wow! Horn's getting the bit of the exchanges for me so far this round. I think so. He's done a minute left, Colonel. And Jeff Horn is absolutely giving the fight of his life. Yes, he is, and that's what he needs to do. He pushes uh, Manny down. Manny's smart. He makes himself smaller when Jeff pushes him down. They touch the glove, showing the sportsmanship. Good nice straight right hand through there. Digging body shots. Uppercut in the inside by Horn. Manny misses it over the head. Oh. Catches him with the left hand. That stung Jeff then. He got the right in the chin there. He wore it well though. Nice combination of punches by Manny Pago, but there's no quit in the Hornets. Turns his back to him. Clips him with the left hand again. Yeah, and he's just having a good spurt there in this round up. He's clipped Horn about 40 seconds ago, and he's capitalizing on that shot. But Horn has won two minutes and about 15 seconds of this round. I'm going to give Horn the round. I don't know. I it's think close. I agree. It's a very close round. This is a very difficult fight for me to call and be fair because I know both of them so well, and there are reasons why I want to see both guys win, you know? It's tough, Danny.
Here's that combination. He smashed him right. The club, the side, the head there, beautiful. St started with the left rip and then came around, made him close up in the middle, then came around the outside with a tech foot right hook to the chin of Manny Pacquiao. Glenn Rushton. Bang, right in the chin. That was a damaging, that was the most damaging shot of the fight. Yeah, but look at the strength that uh, Horn is showing by uh, being able to stand up. Remember, Manny hasn't knocked anybody out in about eight years, but he's a master boxer when he's showing that. Glenn Rushton has done a great job in that corner of Jeff Horn, along with Ben Horn's brother, Steve Edwards is uh, one of the cut men. Adam Copeland, of course, Dundee Kim is the strength and conditioning coach. The other corner is Freddie Roach, Blue Boy Fernandez, Justin Fortune, the strength coach, and Miguel Diaz, one of the best cut men in the world. So here we go to round number four, the Colonel Bob Shirt with Danny Green. 50,000 plus in Sun Court Stadium in Brisbane, Australia. Good right hand from Jeff Horn. He just clocked him with a lovely left hook. Manny Pacquiao smiling, but I tell you now, he doesn't like it. No, he doesn't like it at all. Nice side to side movement, making it difficult for Manny to land his shot. This is real good. Glenn Rush has done a terrific job in training Jeff for Manny Pacquiao because Manny's a very hard guy. That time he got the left hand through. Horn is bobbing up and down, weaving back and forth. Nice slick move. He pushed Manny's head down and tried to catch him again. Good work, he goes down. That's uh, going to be a push down. Mark Nelson right on top of him. No question it was a proper call. But Jeff grabs him around the head and then blasts him away from the referee's side with the right hand. You mean it's a fight. You've got to do what you've got to do to get away. Exactly well. right, Danny. Nobody knows that better than you, and former Manny's, world champ. Man, he's got his tricks in there too, man. He's doing things that he probably maybe shouldn't do, but he's getting away with it. It's a fight. There's nothing too rough about it. But Jeff's doing exactly what he needs to do to a legend, and Manny Pacquiao show him no respect and rough him up. Jeff bounces left, bounces right, shoots out the right hand, lands on the chin of Manny, but hasn't taken a big toll yet. It's the right hand power. That's Jeff. Oh! Good one. That's Jeff oh. right. Manny came back and caught him. Now Manny's juiced up. He felt the power of that right hand for the first time. Jeff landed one front. Oh. Caught him with the left hand that time. Both landed cracking shots. Jeff's conditioning is allowing him to, to shrug them off, otherwise that would hurt him. If he wasn't in such great shape, what Colonel, he'd be hurt. But... He's in the best shape of his life, Danny, and some said that you think he may have overtrained, not according to Glenn Rutherford, not according to, uh, to Jeff. You know, he, he, he paced himself, the blood continues to trickle from that right eye. What I'm really break, break. surprised is showing the hand speed of Jeff Horn uh, very, very quick in this fight against Manny Pacquiao. Uppercut he lands. Manny kind of falls forward. I don't know if it hurt him or not because he has so much strength and power in the legs as Manny Pacquiao. Um, if, if Jeff keeps applying this pressure and keeps landing these, no, got, these, these clean shots, they're going to take their toll, Colonel. Sooner or later, that's the idea for Horn fans. Body shot loaded up the right hand and a whistle past the whispers. That cut could be a problem. We're going to be past the fourth round after this one. Then if the fight has to be stopped because of the cut, it's a TKO. Well, if, it, if it's one that's cut and it's a TKO, he loses. Well, passed, just about passed the fourth round. He can then wings away with a left hand. Looking to land the right, he turned around southpaw for a second. Walks into an up again. Gotta give it to Horn. Horn round, another one. He's, a, he's, he's far ahead, mate. What a cracking performance he's putting up so far. Good round, Jeff. Good work. Good work. We should have that round. I got 39-37. That That's round. unofficial. Oleska we Ron from New York. Chris Flores from Arizona in the USA. And Ramon Serdan from Argentina are the official judges. But if Horn is not in front by a couple of points, he's right there. Tried to get your one big left, it missed because you're moving left. So beautiful. Keep zoning left. Promoter Dan Mike will be absolutely thrilled with the turnout, the show, the whole event, and the way that his fight is going. Unbelievable. Yeah, and the split up between Dean and his partner Higgins. David Higgins is going to work with Joseph Parker. He's supposed to fight in the fall. And Dean said, that's fine. I'm going to stay right here and promote in Australia, which is great from Australia. OK, here we go. The fifth round, Danny Green and the Colonel Bob Sheridan. Our principals, as you know, Manny Pacquiao with the multicolored trunks in the black with the oranges, the Hornet. 
Jeff Horn from right here in Brisbane, Australia. By golly, the town has turned out for this one. 50,000 plus. What a promotion. Biggest crowd to see a fight in Australia. Oh, good left rip. Solid right hand. Man, he claps. Jeff doesn't buy. He doesn't buy it. He continues to bang the body. Good shots in there. Cracking shots. He's hitting the body hard in there. There's no fooling around from Jeff Horn. Man, he's trying to psych him a little bit. Whoa, with the right hand. And that's the one, you know, Jeff has a tendency sometimes to drop that left hand, and Manny's right hand can be dangerous. Horn has him back in the corner, and Manny fights his way out. And Manny's power comes from those big, heavy thigh, heavy uh, calves that he's got in his legs. Downstairs again. Jeff seems busier than Manny, you know? I'm, Way busier. I'm trying to look for a reason to give Manny a, this round, and I'm telling you, Jeff is just busier, landing more shots. Right. Gets Stop. counted that time, does Jeff as he comes in. He felt the power of that right hand from Manny. He's pressing the action, Colonel. He's throwing more shots, and he's landing. Goes right for that body. Catches Manny with his left hand down by the liver, Hands and he free. walks him and Hands spins free. him and continues to hit him on the inside. No respect, and that's exactly what Owen has to do. Don't give him any respect. I'm Manny surprised. wants to grin at you. Go ahead and grin. Surprised Manny hasn't stopped that, picked it up, you know? At least get his hand up there and stop it, but uh, we'll see as it continues to develop. Jeff has got to, he can't do that. He's got to step up in there, just like that. Catch him with the jab. He can't be fading with his jab. He can't Wait, be posturing with his jab. He's got to get a piece of him, whether it's on the chin or the body, just to stop Manny from coming in. Wow, with the left hand is Manny Pacquiao. Horn's positioning is good. Get a little squared up that time and allows Manny Pacquiao to come in on him. Jeff bounces left, back to his right. Manny lets go with the head down, but no ball being the nose. Jeff oh. with right back in his own, and he clips him. Fade through the right, Manny gets flipped again. Now there's no smile on Pacquiao's face right now. Jeff Clifton with some solid shots, and Manny missed his Great. left hand power shot. Wow, Look. how about the pace of this fight for welterweight championship fight? Fantastic fight, mate. And that sun's going down a bit, the cool air started to blow, it's gonna cool these fighters down, they need it. Very hot in there. Manny comes back. Oh, Jeff got hit and rocked. That one hey. uh, set his legs down. He got hit right before the bell that time. Well, uh, how do you score that, Colonel? It's a tough round to score, mate. I think the judges will be split on that, so I'll put it down as 10 10. Yeah, maybe come see, back at the end. I can see either way that that could go, so I think the judges might be split. Our job is not to score the fight, but give you folks watching around the world an indication of how it may be going. So with that said, I've got a 47-49 oh. with Horn still out in front. But there's a long way to go. And Pacquiao's been the distance many a time. Just missing with a couple of shots there, Pacquiao catching up. Those little right hands there, I'm surprised Pacquiao hasn't put a stop to him. Oh, good jab by Manny Pacquiao, beautiful right hand. Bang, he's both clipped each other with Horn and the better league's change. Horn's right hand was better than Pacquiao's left. That was a big right hand that he clipped him with. So if we think the judges were split on that, I still have Horn slightly out in front in this fight. All right, the Colonel Bob Sheridan with Danny Green, Suncor Stadium, 50,000 plus here. Biggest promotion in the history of Australia. What a job by Dean Lonegan to put it together. And now we see Manny Pacquiao in the red and blue and white in his trunks and the hornet jeff horn in black and orange let's see if horn can sustain what he's been doing as he crashes for the body oh. nice uppercut on the inside horn tries to capitalize again blast the body again downstairs good work by jeff horn just bullying back out of there now manny is annoyed let's see how he reacts to this they've done a terrific job on that right eye of jeff horn kudos to the corner yeah, very good job. Manny's getting out hustled. And Pacquiao's normally the hustler in the fight, you know? Jeff's doing it to him this time. That's He's a bot. pulling him in close. Time, time. All right, 
It was a hit Accidental headbutt. Accidental headbutt. Okay. Pacquiao got a cut in the side of his head. It's not going to affect his vision, though. That's an accidental headbutt, but it's up it's in okay. the hairline, so accidental it's not a problem. Button. It was a headbutt, Manny. Ready to go? Okay, I'm gonna. Are you right? I'm saying. And this corner, okay? Remember, we're after four rounds, so if that fight had to be stopped because of that cut, we go to the scorecards. Because it was a butt as opposed to a punch. Very important to remember, ready? folks. You ready? Okay. Time in. Here we go. Of course, your scalp, as you know, Danny, bleeds a lot, so it looks a yeah. lot worse than it is. No quitting horn. He keeps coming forward. Danny bounces around to his left, tries to counter with his own right hand. Horn keeping the pressure on him. Boy, Horn's coming in and getting to that Stop. body every time. Oh, he's all over Manny Pacquiao. It's a ripping performance by Jeff Horn so far. So far. And I don't see, I haven't seen an answer yet for Manny. He hasn't really worked Horn's puzzle out. He's a very, very difficult guy to work out. But you, you know, Danny, you, you said it. He's just flat out hustling oh. Manny right now. Wait, but Manny's so Stop. slick, and there's a long time to go in this fight, and it's close. We're in the sixth round. Pacquiao's been through the wars. Jeff just doesn't sit still. He just throws punches from all over the place. He's unorthodox, he's awkward, and he's effective. Good body shot there by Manny Pacquiao. Just threw that right down the bread box. And that's his power shot with the left hand downstairs. He cut, uh, that'll show you the hand speed. He cut Jeff that time too. Jeff goes digging downstairs. Boy, he's doing a lot for the body as he leads in, you know? Both in the area of the liver. That time Manny gets his hands up and prevents Jeff from whacking him around the head anymore. And I wonder when that was gonna start. Swan trying to put the pressure on him again, goes with the right hand lead. Anything to get Manny just a little bit off. Of course, the right hand is a way to beat the southpaw down the middle. Horn faints, Manny misses. Stop! Now, this is usually where Horn whacks him inside, but not in position to do it that time as the referee was watching him. Oh, oh man! Set Manny down on his heels. Jeff realized that Manny says, come on! Jeff Horn's fighting. Wait. If he keeps this up, he's going to stop Manny Pacquiao. He's taking a well, lot of punishment. Yeah, man, he is taking a lot. Of, he's not smiling anymore either. But remember, he's been down this road so many times. Greeny, we don't want to get too excited right no, now. No way. He's an all-time legend, 11-time world champion. But he's just, he's, he's getting out work, he's getting out box, he's getting out punch, he's getting out muscle. There's one thing for sure. Jeff Horn has come to fight and put on a great show. And I got him winning that round as well. Yeah, I got Horn. I got Horn four rounds to two. Here comes the uppercut from Jeff Horn in close. Smack. Right through the gloves. Very, very clean scoring shot there. Beautiful shot. And they hurt. They're damaging the uppercuts. You ask any fighter, what's the worst punch you hit by? An uppercut. They hurt. Well, I have Horn out in front by three points unofficially. Remember, I had the fifth round even. I gave Horn one, I gave Pacquiao two, Horn three and four. Fifth one too close to call for me and Horn, I gave the sixth round. So let's say the judges went to the fifth for Manny Pacquiao. It's a two point fight halfway through the fight. So no dominance here, but certainly a great performance by Jeff Horn against a legend, an absolute living legend, an icon. Horn. Black and orange. Now Manny oh. wants to pick it up, but he cracks him pretty good. Good start. The best start to a round he's had so far, but tenacious as Horn is, he's just in his face. Well, Manny's getting real serious now. It looks like he's got the adrenaline flow in his face. I remember when Larry Holmes would see him, his head start to rock back and forth with the adrenaline flow would come. Manny doing a better job countering Jeff coming in now. Jeff has got to get a piece of him with that lead hand every time. If he doesn't get a piece, man, he does counter him. Remember, this fight is close. Another right hand lead that scores. Wasn't flush, but still scoring. Manny able to get that right hand out there and hold off Jeff. Jeff has got to get a piece of him. He faded that time, and he's very fortunate that Manny didn't pull the trigger on his left hand. This is a better round for Manny back here now. Good right hand oh, there, but good solid, counter for Manny Pacquiao. Yeah, solid stuff to the body. This is hard Rick, stuff there, right above him. Just bangs him with the left hand again inside. He's done that so many times during the course of the fight. 
I definitely think the Manny Pacquiao wouldn't have realised how strong Jeff Horn is physically. He's not an arm-punch knockout banger, but he's got strength and power. Well, if he catches him with a flush one punch, you know, the only trouble is that Manny's legs are so strong he can gobble up a solid shot. Ready. Although I have seen him knocked out with one punch. Loads up the left hand and that whistle past the whiskers of Jeff Horn. Horn sets up in front of him. This round is very even about midway through it. Manny came out fast. Jeff clicked him with the right hand. Yeah, good shots there from Jeff. Just keeping it simple, nice and straight. Then he'll mix it up. He'll come around the body, he'll come up the middle, come over the top, come in the middle again. He's just not letting Manny get his rhythm. Now, that's the, that's the right thing, and Jeff, he's got to catch him with his lead hand, whether he throws the right or left hand. He's got to get a piece of him every time. If he doesn't, Manny will counter him. Manny doing a nice job here, but Jeff catches him, walks him back, but he takes an uppercut on the oh. side. Right hand lands by Jeff. Jeff comes after him again. Pacquiao bounces off the ropes. Jeff Horn using his weight there, leaning on him, taking Manny Pacquiao's energy. He's fighting a very clever fight. Stay here. Another time has been a clash. I think the heads came together again. Accidental butt. Another oh. accidental butt. Accidental butt here. Head up, head up, head up. Same thing. Got a small bleeding. Nothing going go on the eyes. Let's clean him up a little more. Right. Well, we'll move the, we'll the corner. It's going to go bleeding now. All right, so Manny's cut Watch to the, the left heads. side. Okay. Come here. It often happens with a taller and shorter, and also with a southpaw and an orthodox fighter, Danny, as you know. Now there's Jeff an urgency, Paul. but Jeff lands the right hand. Now Pagan picks it up. Jeff cracks him with the right hand again. Left hand, right hand upstairs. Jeff Does he have him hurt? I don't know. Oh, nice uppercut by Manny Pacquiao. Oh. Just when you think that Manny be in trouble. He comes Quick. back and cracks Horn with a left hand and a nice uppercut on the inside. Fantastic. Closing, closing seconds now in the seventh round. Fantastic action there by Watch Jeff Horn. Quick. Manny Pacquiao coming home strong. I'm going to give that round to Jeff Horn. Well, the crowd loves it. We're into the past the seventh round now. Just relax. We've got this fight. You just have to take this. How'd you score that round, Colonel? I gave Give it to Jeff head. as Give well. Remember, Horn was cut back in the second round. There was an accidental clash of heads in the fifth. Manny was cut up in the headline. I'm not 100% head. sure clean where clean that second clean cut is, block. Danny, but it was another accidental headbutt. Let's listen. Other side, other side. That is Miguel Diaz, one of the best cut men in the world, working on Manny. He's got his work cut out for him, Colonel. Well, he is one of the best. If not the best. Looks like he was working up in the hairline again, though. Yeah. That's okay. It bleeds a lot, but it's not going to end the fight. But the actual head clash, they hurt too. Beautiful scoring, thumping right hand inside of Pacquiao's face. We go to the eighth round, the Colonel Bob Shorten with Danny Green. Time, time, time. Time Danny has been called here. again. Let's see what Mark Nelson is doing. Well, Cut it. There's tape off. Well, the left well, glove and the telling men. They tape it up or cut about it. About 10 hours to Just do that, it. which is what a good corner man would do. Take as much time Thank as he can to give his fighter a, a bit more respect. Okay, time in, time in. Time is back in, so here we go. This is round eight. Long way to go, Horn out in front in the fight to this point. But man, he's a real serious. But see that blood trickling down from the eye? Straight left in. There is a sense of urgency to Manny right now. I can see it in all his movements, his legs, the way he's bouncing. Watch for the left hand power. This is where Horn can't let this guy crawl back into the fight. Horn doing the smart thing every time he gets in close. Instead of letting Manny come with that uppercut on the inside, which he frequently does, he grabs him and hangs on him, walks him back to take the power away. Jeff did clip with a straight right hand by Manny. Left hand came in, but Jeff blocked most of it. Manny right in front of him. Jeff needs to touch him when he does that. That jab is no good. He touched him with that right hand, though. Yeah, Pacquiao's a bit more evasive this round. He's, he's not going to let Jeff get him on the ropes and just have his way with it, man. He's just 
but he's not landing many clean shots back here. Horn is evasive. It's awkward and evasive. As his nickname Great. says, he's buzzing around like an angry hornet. Well, he is, but he himself has missed some punches too. He's lunging in sometimes, but every time he goes in, he's got to catch a piece. Oh. Nice straight oh, That is a push, not a knockdown. Good job by Mark Nelson. No knockdown. Had Nelson called out a knockdown, the fight changes immediately. Yep. It's dead even. He actually stunned Jeff a little bit there. Jeff scored a, scored a beautiful jab, and Manny countered with the left hand. And this is the experience of Manny Pacquiao. Jeff Horn is only in his 18th professional fight. Manny has 38 professional knockouts. It's just such a great effort from Jeff Horn so far. He can, he can sense he can do this. He's Listen confident. to the crowd. Jeff's self-belief is immense. Freak! And as a fighter colonel, you have to have that self-belief, and Jeff is oozing it. Yes, he is. Round number eight, it's scheduled for 12. We've got one up front, but Manny coming on a bit. Jeff hasn't landed a real stinging punch, and he gets clipped himself pretty hard that time. His pack heel coming in. He just cracked Jeff with a good left hand in. Yeah, he did. Jeff is a little bit out on his feet just here right now. There's no quit in this guy. Now Manny is battling back on the inside. Now Horn, it comes back to him, walk the guy back. Jeff's legs on 100% right now. He felt some uh, power of that Manny back there. Yeah, it's spongy. Oh, he caught him with the left hand, though. There's the bell. That's a Pacquiao round. What a top fight it's turning out to be, Colonel. Giving this crowd an absolute cracker. What a show this young kid's putting on. And Manny Pacquiao, the 11 time legend, is responding. I've got the fight three rounds in favor of Horn with four rounds to go. Remember, we had the one even round. So this thing could be a little bit closer than what we have it. Yeah, he was pushed over there by Pacquiao, but he hit him just before he hit him. The other thing is that you got to remember as you watch the replay, Pacquiao's been here before. Jeff hasn't. For We're in the ninth round. For me, Colonel, I think Jeff Horn is going to come home even stronger than he's been fighting here because he can sense it. He's four rounds away from pulling off an incredible victory. All right, here we go. This is round number nine. Oh, lovely right hand to the great box. And you were absolutely right, Danny. He started right out to come right at him. Bang, Manny, with that right hand. He's got to touch him with that lead hand every time. Because every time he doesn't touch him, Manny comes and counters him. There it is. Just All you got to do is just nick him. And it takes away the power. Pacquiao just hasn't, have, hasn't, hasn't had an answer for Jeff's evasiveness. And his power inside, he's very strong. He's manhandling Manny Pacquiao in there, which is incredible to watch. Yeah, well, you know, he's a much bigger guy. What, what do you think he weighs? He's probably, what, uh, 50, close to 60 yeah, right now after he, rehydrating? Just barely made the 47 he's yesterday. put on a bit of weight, mate. He's, he's at least put on, I'd say, you know, 12 pounds. He's just shot, man. He realizes he caught him. Horn knows how to tie him up and doing a nice job. His Pacquiao on the assault now. Horn backing off. He can't allow Manny to do this. This is the first time Manny's getting off first in the fight. That last punch must have hurt Horn a little bit. Oh. He plants himself. Stephane. Manny and put Stephane. the pressure on him. Putting a lot of pressure on him now. He's got to hang on to him. This is vintage Manny Pacquiao. Horn has got to catch him with that lead hand coming yeah. in. Good work in there by Jeff Horn. He got halfway through the round. He's feeling the pinch, though. He's very fatigued. You can see it in his face. Oh, he's staggered it. Here comes Manny. He's on the assault. He's staggered Jeff Horn. Caught him with the left hand. Wow, with the left hand is Manny back here. Horn nails him with the right hand. But he's still on his feet. Horn's fighting a pure card. Big right hand by Manny back here. Horn backs off. His back here puts the pressure on him. A lot of pressure on him. Good work by Manny Pacquiao. Jeff Horn's got to hang on. He's got to hang on. He's fatigued. He's, he's got to hang on. He's in big trouble right now, Danny. Oh, come on. Manny knows he's got him in trouble. 
Manny Pacquiao proving his class, his strength, his experience. Jeff Horn's got to use his youthful vitality if he can just hang on and get a rest in between rounds. Jeff is out on his feet right now, and Manny's putting the pressure on. Long time in boxing circles. 40 seconds to go in this round. Jeff, that's exactly what he needs to do. Grab him. He's still out on his feet, but he does have tremendous recuperative power. He can't allow Manny to tag him one more time. Oh, he just caught Jeff coming in there. He's out his feet. Jeff Horn, what a tough kid. What a warrior. But so is Manny Pacquiao. Oh, he's both. eating up Jeff badly in this round. This actually could be a 10-8 round. The judges won't score it that way without a knockdown. Jeff Horn, Jeff Horn ready to go. Closing seconds, Horn stung again. That's the bell. That's a big round for Manny Pacquiao. What an incredible round by Pacquiao. Jeff Horn's going to have to suck up. And let's see how much resolve this young animal's got. This is what you worked so hard for, brother. Come on. Three rounds, Jeff. Come on, brother. Sorry. Yes. I just had a good shot. Jeff. Listen, I'm here to protect you, OK? I think you had enough. He's all right. Oh, no, no. You want to continue? Yes, he's okay. Show me something in this round, or we're going to stop the fight. Yep, yep. That's it. I don't know if you could hear it, but Mark Nelson said, you're taking enough. I'm here to protect you. Show me something in this round. Oh, that's it. Mark Nelson, a veteran of over 80 world title fights, so he's seen it. But Pacquiao, for the first time, went on the lead and on the aggressiveness in the ninth round. He was off the leash that round, Colonel. Now we find out what kind of recuperative power Jeff has. He's still got to get off first. He's young. He's hungry. He's still, his legs aren't 100% back yet, though. And Manny knows it. Manny oh. tries to time that uppercut, almost catches Wait. Jeff. It's been a remarkable fight, but Pacquiao turned it all around on the ninth round. He did everything oh. but drop Jeff. Jeff got nailed coming in. He's getting beat to the punch now, and that wasn't happening earlier. Jeff is still not 100% no, 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 okay. back from the punishment he took in the ninth round. He took a lot of punishment in the ninth round. Straight right hand gets through. Now he seems to be recuperating a little bit. But Manny tags him with the left hand inside. Don't forget, that would have taken a toll on Manny Pacquiao, chasing him around the ring because he smelt it. He could sense fear, he could sense, not fear, he could sense he was hurt. And it takes a lot of energy from a fighter when you're going on the, on the, on the onslaught. Jeff cracks him inside, but no power behind that. Manny says, come on in, I can counter punch you. Great, I got it. Manny told me before, I want him to attack me. I want him coming in so I can count him. Jeff seems back right now. I think he's recovered well, mate. That, that training camp, obviously, that vitality of being a younger guy is, is now coming into, into plays. He's got his feet back. He's looking, he's looking active. He's got to stop Pacquiao from getting off first, though. Stop. He, stop. Manny started that in the last round. You see Manny come back upstairs. That's the first time he did that. He's trying to intimidate Jeff Horn right now. Horn gets a piece of him coming in. That's all he has to do. Jeff up in his toes. He makes Manny Pacquiao miss. Manny sets up in front of him. Jeff comes in and doesn't get a piece of him. And that's lethal with Manny's power. It's a good shot in close there by Manny Pacquiao. Jeff Horn. not the trouble, Danny. Jeff is not landing anything real clean right now. He's putting the pressure on Manny Pacquiao. Look at this! Jeff does catch him with a clean shot. Pacquiao battles back. Very good shot there by Jeff Horn. Wow, what a cracking fight. This kid's just, he's won a nation's heart so far. I just don't know how much sting Jeff has in his punches right now. As if you notice, he put his heel down first when he walked forward. That's a sign that his legs are a little tired. There's and that, they should be. There's that saying, Colonel walking on his heels. He's, like, he's fatigued, he's a little bit stumped. He's up on his toes now. Blood streaming from that cut that they've done a real nice job on throughout the course of the fight. Manny would like to land that left hand on top of it. Beautiful kind of right hand there by Jeff Horn. 12 seconds to go. It's a very key round in the fight. I think the judge is going to give that round to Manny Pacquiao, though. 
And it, fun. Let's see it, it is a through. tough round. If the judges give that to Pacquiao, there's only a point separating him on my score sheet. Oh my God. Two rounds, okay? You got a that was a round? great round. You won that round. You come back to win it. Two rounds. Let's lift the work rate a bit, but not. Don't get predictable. Still got to watch the recovery. Zone left. Move the head. Go to 95 in my scorecard. Right favor of Horn still. Some judges could have given that eighth round. But the ninth round. To Pacquiao, 10 8. Some judges could have done that. The last two rounds have really evened the fight up. You know, more not in favor of Pacquiao. I, I think definitely still looking behind the scorecards. But the last two rounds, I think Pacquiao's just edging back a little bit. Jeff needs to come home hard these two rounds. Jeff has got to reach down in places where he's never reached before. But Pacquiao, it's another day and another championship fight. He's been here before. Look for Jeff getting off first, if he can do that. He's got the bounce in his legs again, Danny. He has, mate. He has. He can smell it. He's six minutes away. Six minutes away from just absolute elation. But again, in that ninth round, if the judges win 10-8, and they well good, you got a dead even fight. People yelling, Hornet, Hornet. And the backfield people will chant as well. Manny not getting off first in this 11th round. So you wonder how much is taken out of him from all of his aggressiveness. Jeff back. You notice that he's touched him again, Danny, when he comes in. Jeff is certainly fatigued, but so is Manny. This is where Jeff wants him on the ropes. He can go to work while he's doing it. Start clubbing. They're hurting him. They're hurting Pacquiao. They're slowing him down, Colonel. Hands, hands free, guys. Quick, but much. more important, he's got the old, what do we call it, Jinnigar. He's got it back again. The old... The friskiness back again. He's got the bounce in the legs. Jab, jab. But you've got to touch him with the jab. A man, he can do things like that. You can't miss. You've got to touch him. you got to get a piece of him. Come down a little bit. Get him oh. in the Right oh. hand. Big left hand. Good counter by Jeff Foreman. He got stung there by Pacquiao. Oh, hard. His legs went right down. He buckled in the knees for that shot. Good jab by Jeff Horn. Jeff, Jeff has got tremendous recuperative power because I thought his legs were gone. They're not 100% right now, but this kid is so tough, Stop. and it means so much to him. Horn right in this fight as the blood trickles from the right eye and the nostril. He's got to get off first. There's a lot of time left in this round. Minute 70, 16 seconds. Got to get off first. Watch for that, folks. And he's got to get a piece of him. He's not getting a piece of him now. Pacquiao will count him. Every time Jeff misses, Pacquiao will count him. Man, he's got his full, Wait, full me. wherewithal right now. Get your scissors. He's tired. But he's still got plenty of bounce. Jeff Horn's got that pop back. Oh, he just missed with the right hand there. He's still throwing some good shots, Jeff Horn. Oh, good body that's shot by Manny Pacquiao. Yeah. Terrific body Cut. shot. And that's oh, yeah. the kind of shot that takes it all. Cut it. Both fighters need this break. It'll help them both. Colonel. Take your time, Glenn. Don't rush it. Time in. Jeff's legs aren't 100% right now. But, boy, he has really let everything go. And no matter what happens good in this shot. fight now, Horn is on the scene. Pacquiao comes forward, misses. Horn's got to oh. catch him. The Horn missed him coming in. Pacquiao blocked him when he came in then. Jeff looks totally exhausted, and he is. See, he's not tricking with him when he comes in. He's missing the shot. Earlier in the fight, the heads came together again. Closing oh. seconds, man, he missed that. He grazed the nose but didn't catch him. That jab caught Jeff. Jeff couldn't let the right hand go. Wow. Got to give it a pack, yo. I think so, that round, yeah. It's going to be an incredible last round, Colonel. This is warming up to be an absolute corker. This is either dead oh, even or pack. Oh, it might be a point ahead. The way I have it, anyway. This is make or break, Colonel. This is make or break for Jeff Horn. Three minutes left, and this will be the biggest moment of his life. Can he do it? Remember, we had one round that was too close to call back in the fifth. Wow, big left hand there. That's the shot that stung Jeff. But as you said, he recuperated very quickly. He's obviously had an incredible training camp, and then Manny just, there it was there. Came back and scored some clean shots of his own. 
On my score sheet, I get a 105-105. We go back when Manny was out on his uh, head, Jeff out on his feet in the ninth. Some judges may have scored that a 10-8 round. If that's the case, then most the likely Pacquiao's ahead by a point. Oh, there it is. The hair is standing up in my neck. The crowd are on their feet. It's championship time. Everybody is on his feet. Here's Jeff Horn. The last big three minutes of this huge promotion. Pacquiao's been here before. Horn hasn't. Jeff Ruff housing Manny Pacquiao and then so inside there and then he knew what he has to do there. It's very good tactics from his team, just headlock him, push him away. It's great, but he's got to get a piece of him coming in. Manny seems to have the more powerful punches right now. Jeff pouring, he faints, he comes in, goes with the right hand lead, doesn't catch Manny. Misses Manny again. Every time Manny gets off first, he gets a piece of Jeff, and Jeff is missing him right now with his lead hand. Both fighters exhausted. They're both going up in their shield no matter how this thing ends. Uh, there won't be any other. Right. Big right hand by Jeff Horn, but it doesn't ship Pacquiao. Does stick Jeff. Right hand again. Manny Pacquiao stunned. He may be. Time has been called again. The tape coming off that. Dan Marston taking his time. Both of these guys were exhausted. Oh. Manny catches him downstairs. Horn back upstairs. Minute 51 seconds to go. What a fight! Look at this! They both want it so bad. The oh. World Championship on the line. Pacquiao scoring with a lethal left hand there after that combination. Jeff's legs, are they okay? Yeah, he seems to have the bounce in him okay. Oh. Big right hand that time by Manny. Jeff has got to catch that lead hand coming in. Pacquiao catches him again. Right hand. Good shots there by Jeff Horn. He's got to keep him in there. He's got to right. just keep on the onslaught. He's got a minute 16 seconds to have the best feeling he's ever going to feel in his boxing life. Both guys bleeding profusely. Manny's got two cuts in his hairline on the inside. This has been some war. It's been a what great a tremendous, fight. tremendous fight. Pacquiao seems to be beating with oh. a punch. Jeff loaded up wow. the right hand. The sail right up over the shoulder. Manny Pacquiao. What a, what a fight. fight. 52 seconds. 50 seconds to go. Does Horn have it in him to finish strong enough? It's that close. Great. Very good. Manny Pacquiao oh. started out smiling. He isn't smiling right now. Oh, he puts Horn back in his heels with that left hand. Oh, big left hand. Manny. Oh, right hand by Pacquiao. Back and forth and goal. He refuses to give in, Jeff Horn. He, there is no quitting, Jeff Horn, and he's been stunned very bad back in the ninth round. Jeff's got a bit of pop in his, in his, in his feet now. Well, if he has, he's got to catch Manny. We're almost out of time. Look at this. He's finishing like a warrior, but he has both of them. It's all over. What a fight. Go either way, Danny. I get it 115, 115. Couldn't make up my mind in the last round. The judges may lean towards the champion of that. It was that close, but by golly, that's some oh, fight. That's you a mad? hard this fight thing? to call. And it's, it's difficult to know the score because I mean I'm right here watching it, but if I was at home, I'd probably have scored a bit easier because there's less emotion involved. But the thing is here you can see how heavy the punches yeah. are, and you can't see that at all. Man, it's so tight. Now, uh, this one will be left to the judges as far as I'm concerned. It could be a point one way or the other. Remember in the close rounds that we threw up 10 tenths? Judges have a tendency to give that to the champion. If that's the case, Manny wins by a couple of points. Well, Jeff Horn has absolutely just compelled us with this. His, his, his effort here is just unbelievable. I've got to say, he surprised me in as far as how just assertive he was over Manny Pacquiao, a legend. What a great performance in, in, the, in the 18th fight. In the later rounds of the fight, as you watch the replay, Danny, I'll let you take it. Wow, here we go. All of the ropes once again. Good body work there. Manny rolling. I know this is just towards the end of the fight, I think. Both trading heavy shots, not really collecting each other. 
So the heads head there. Again. Jeff getting a bit, a bit better at that exchange, and that's the fight over. Both teams think they've won. There's going to be one very, very happy person and one very, very upset person, unfortunately. Well, Horn was cut for the right eye. Then there were the head clashes. Manny was cut in the fifth round. Jeff was uh, out on his feet in the ninth round. Battled back. And Pacquiao won 10 and 11. 12 up for grabs. If Pacquiao wins 12, he probably wins the fight. But this could be one or two points either way. I think Horn might have pulled it out. Who knows? We'll see. Oh, mate. What a, if, he, if he's got it, it's going to be amazing. Okay, let's find out. Here is Michael Buffer with the official particulars. Ladies and gentlemen, before we go to the scorecards, a round of applause for a great display of guts and courage in this ring here in Brisbane, Australia tonight for Jeff Horn and Manny Pacquiao. Here are the score totals. Well, Oscar Roldan scores it 117 to 111. Chris Flores scores it 115 to 113. Same score from Roman Caron, 115 to 113. All three scores go to the winner by unanimous decision. And new the overweight champion of the world, the fighting prime of Brisbane, Queensland, Australia. How do you like the it? Hornet. Jeff Horn, the brand new WBO oh. welterweight champion of the world. Jeff Horn has done it. Has it worked out, Danny, in those close rounds? They gave him the other way to Horn. He wins by a couple of points. We had a dead even. Wow.